The training course offers a real appreciation for people that want to know more about scaffolding design and what it actually is, um, what goes into it and what people actually can expect from a scaffolding design um, and what they can expect from a scaffolding design company. It lets them appreciate what we do, what we have to put into designs and just generally give them an appreciation of how complicated it is in some respects or how simple it can be in other respects. People should invest in Forte Plan 3 training. They're going to see huge benefits from the course. They're going to be able to do their job better. Estimators, QSers, supervisors, advanced scaffolders, anyone working in a scaffolding profession is going to benefit hugely from just knowing more about scaffolding design. They're going to do offer a better service to their clients, they're going to be able to interact better with the design, they're going to be able to understand the specifications of scaffolding a whole lot better. Anyone working, procuring, managing scaffolding will do a whole better job because they can actually now understand just what, they've got, what they should be getting from a scaffolding design and the complexities that go into it and what they can do a little bit more to help the scaffolding design process and help them get a better service from their scaffolding contractor. On the day they can expect a flavour of what 48.3 is about but how we manifest that in training is through professionalism and detail. They can expect a mixture of theory, practical examples, model making, demonstrations on the overhead projector and just the ability to ask us practicing design engineers any question they like on any technical subject, dispel any queries and any um, fears they might have maybe about scaffolding design. People should come on the course because it gives them an appreciation of what scaffold designers have to deal with on a daily basis. So we look at the British standards, European standards, the different regulations that we have to deal with, and also stability, rigidity of structures. Uh, one of the unique things about the scaffold design appreciation is the method that we use in terms of we have a set structure that we have content we try and deliver throughout the two days, but also we can take key areas that are of a particular interest to the delegates and focus on those areas to give them answers to questions they've maybe had. Well the learners can expect a quite a varied delivery style. We have some great presentations and videos for visual learners that like to look at things on a big screen. We've got a really, really detailed course manual, so we put a lot of time and effort into getting all the complex information down in a nice, simplistic way so that people that want to read it in their own time can go away and do that. And then we've got some really cool models. We've got beam spans, we've got braced scaffold towers and sheeted models and things that allow people to touch and feel and interpret the uh, terminology and the things that are being taught on the course in a practical way. The reason I attended the course today was to get a better understanding from the design element as a scaffolding contractor to basically cascade down to responsible people as in managers, supervisors, to give them a better understanding so they know where the design process starts and finishes. I'm an instructor at the CITB in Glasgow. I was looking to improve my knowledge base, simplify things for the boys that will be in front of me and just clarify technical points. Uh, the main things I enjoyed about the course were the practical elements, um, learning about more about the calculations uh, behind the de designs. For, for me personally I've enjoyed the, the, the quite in-depth analysis of the design, I didn't think it would be that in-depth um, and be able to discuss certain issues because a lot of it's not black and white so you can actually discuss with, uh, with Ben and Ivic certain issues that has been really good. Uh, the course content has been very good, very easy to understand. It's been put along uh, excellently by the, 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 the lecturers involved. They've made it clear, concise and a very good level of understanding. I, I do really enjoy the, the mix of practical and theoretical um, parts of it and getting involved as well. So yeah, absolutely, I definitely would. A course like this has buried all sorts of misconceptions that I've had and carried with me over the years. Uh, so I think everybody would benefit from attending this two-day course.